The other three events were in Skorkovo, which is just part of Moscow, really, Moscow, Lausanne, and Monaco, Monte Carlo. So we're in good company. And um, obviously, COVID has, has played a part in the um, scheduling, because normally this event wouldn't have been happening now. It would have happened last year, about a year ago, in fact. And um, we've had the opportunity to host this event um, because of the change in scheduling. And um, the government of Gibraltar very um, graciously, and we're very grateful, um, have um, agreed uh, with FIDE to host uh, this wonderful tournament for 12 of the world's top women chess players. Now, Gibraltar has become quite the name for chess tournaments. How significant is this series in particular? I think it's the most prestigious event we've ever run here. I mean, as you know, we normally have 400, 450 visitors in January for chess and accompanying people, um, amateur players, young children uh, and, and top professionals. Um, so we only have 12. Obviously, COVID again is coming up. Are we able to social distance, um, follow all the, uh, the guidelines and uh, regulations? Uh, on that area, you know, and it would have been impossible to host the normal kind of event that we do here. There was no chance of that. Um, and we've already postponed this event once from January until where we are today. Um, and the prestige is, is uh, sky high. I mean, this is the first time that the World Chess Federation, FIDE, have asked us, Gibraltar, to host an official event. So I don't think we could have any better praise and recommendation. Well, given that and given the pandemic generally, I'm sure from an organizer's point of view, you're just relieved that we're able to host a competition like this on the rock. I mean, I'm not sure of any other places in the world that could do this uh, now, apart from Gibraltar, uh, really. And um, plus, of course, we have 18 years experience of organizing high class chess events here. Uh, where we're standing now, you'll see the tournament room has been transformed, a uh, completely different look and feel to the events. Um, we have a nice red carpet here, we have uh, beautiful graphics and we also have live broadcasting every day as we do every year, going out on the internet live around the world and we're promoting Gibraltar, we're promoting women's chess and also let's mention the Queen's Gambit of course, that great series on Netflix which has done wonders for promoting the game of chess around the world and um, here we have, as I said, 12 of the world's best women chess players here in Gibraltar so we couldn't ask for much more.